Panthers training camp continues here in Spartanburg, and I am joined with, let's say, a thousand of my best friends, all here ready to cheer on the Panthers as season approaches in just a few short weeks. I, I tell you guys, the biggest thing I, I, I see every day, and I'm really, really pleased, has been the consistency of our quarter, quarterbacks. I think the decision-making making progress has improved. I think those guys have sped up their decision-making, footwork, all those type of things that, that, that you need to be efficient. But, you know, I think a lot of that's to do with the way Norv sees things and the way Norv's doing things. It's, it's a different way, so uh, that's, that's been good. Um, you know, we just, he had a sore leg, and we wanted to check it out, so we sent him in uh, to get it checked out in Charlotte. If we lose anybody else, I mean, if they come back with bad news, you know, obviously we'll be concerned. So, you know, we, we like where we are right now. We think we've got solid depth, um, and we got a couple of young guys that we really got high hopes for as well. So we, we just have to be really smart and hopefully uh, lucky a little bit too. Hanging out with Mario Addison. Mario, you just finished up practice for the day, but you had the opportunity to spend some time with some kids here from the Boys and Girls Club. How important is it for you to give back in environments like this? Oh, it's very, it's very important. You know, um, like I tell all the reporters, um, or anybody who asked me, you know, when I was growing up, you know, I didn't have all the activities that these young people have these days. So since I didn't have it, it, it feels good to be able to come back and give back to those guys. That way they can have it. Yes, yeah. All right. Another great day here at training camp with all the Panthers faithful getting excited for football. And I've joined in too. I'm excited for all of us here at ADSN. I'm Taylor Davis.